Economic upgrades available on one age earlier. Stable technologies, cavalier, gunpowder. All right, let's go. Also, relics generate both food and gold. This is an interesting one. Let's do Burgundians. What do you feel about the unit selection limit of 60? Mm, for me, it's fine. I rarely have more than 60 units of one type, right? So to me, it doesn't really affect anything. It looked like your reaction times were slower than we've seen in the past. Was that just being thrown off or something else? I think as well. I switched my sleep schedule a lot for this tournament to because uh, I knew I would have later matches every time. And that just made me... I slept until like 2 p.m. on the day. And I just felt drowsy and sloppy the whole day. And that's also something I... I keep doing, and I always feel shit when doing it. That's also something I probably shouldn't try to do. Um, but I don't think that necessarily affected my play. I did have very sloppy openings though, and I got really super punished. Because, like, he comes in with two archers in my base, and I got super punished. Even, to even the second game was just poor scouting on my end, poor opening, it was just... Yeah, a lot of stuff, just... I don't even know. Very disappointed, obviously, with my with my my stuff there. What map are we playing? Arabia. I don't know why they pushed the schedule as well. We used to start 13 GMT, all of a sudden everything started 15 GMT. So they pushed it two hours, which is also way worse for the Asian players. Don't know why that is. Yeah, we don't have uh, sub-messages in general, uh, 40 Gomez. It would just be too much text-to-speech and such. I'm sorry for that. Like, again, don't get me wrong. Viles played amazing. Uh, I was really impressed with his home game, in particular on Kavosan. But at the same time, Kavosan, when I trained it against Doubt, we, we played Franks against Hans. I beat him with Franks then, and then I played it the same matchup against Viles, and I just switched up my playstyle and my approach. Suddenly I started fighting for both pawns right away, which is something I never did in training. So I pretty much went away from everything I did in training that worked. And it backfired severely. Like I said, it was collective failure on my end. From brain to hands to everything. Do you think the removal of the scouting exploit will lead to changes like more scouting houses getting placed and patrolling armies? Well, we'll see how that how that change uh, affects the game, right? But scouting is definitely going to be way more crucial. Oh, I have upgrades in Dark Age. Wait, do you do horse color now before going to feudal age or before starting to farm? What's the meta? That's going to be an interesting one as well. It depends, indeed. I think on Arena you will definitely do those. <laughs> that's actually, that's one of the really interesting ones. <clears throat> I think you basically didn't want to show any stress for later rounds and the less knew how to punish it. Of course I did hide or kept keep some things because I was expecting to be able to beat Veles. Obviously again that backfired, but I realized right from the start that I wasn't playing as I wanted to. So I should have. But it was already too late then because I had already done the draft and done everything. But still, it is what it is, right? Like I said again, all I can do is take it on the chin, learn from it and improve for the next ball low. Which is already confirmed, like I said. At the end of Wolo 3, it did say CU for Wolo 4. So, Wolo 4 is already confirmed. Did Bless's draft surprise you? Not really. But, like I said, I, again, <laughs> I, I keep going back to this. I just, I drafted sieves and maps that I, that aren't my favorites, aren't. I drafted sieves that I haven't tried once in training for those maps. So, it was just very disappointing for me. A happy worry for doubt, very happy. Like I, I said earlier as well, I think everyone has been waiting for doubt to actually win something big again. And we got some warning signs, right? You guys saw King of the Desert, he beat Leary in the in the group stage. Now there's actually a storyline with Leary and doubt. Who would have thought that doubt and Leary would have a storyline like that <laughs> in 2021? Doubt has beaten Leary in King of the Desert, and now also in uh, Red Bull. 
What am I even going for here? For Gundans. Stable opening seems natural. Cheers for the entertainment and respect for your humility smile. Uh, Thunderstorm, thank you very much for 1129. And yeah, cheers to you as well. Thank you very kindly for the support. Wait, I did 22 pop up. That's not good. So now you see a difference here in the color now. When buildings are placed down, they don't have the same, same light as they normally do, or lighting, because they're not in vision. That's very interesting. Uh, 40 gold missing for, the, for 8 months, Absolute Bread with 41 months, Hisley Konuzan with the Prime, uh, Thunderstorm thanks again for the Dono, Warbrand Fortress with the Prime, Airbender with the 3 months. Thank you. Oh. Wait, this is where you should do the upgrades, right? That makes a lot of sense. On the way to a uh, feudal age. What? I thought this TC was up there. Well, that's that sucks. <laughs> Burgundian sucks, guys. This would not have happened if I was Sicilians. It's all Burgundian. Wait, do I have a barracks? I don't have a barracks. Come here, eat it. Eat it! Oh, I didn't garrison! <laughs> Shit! Okay, I, I'm not sure if it's the keyboard or... Oh, Bosa! I'm not sure if it is the keyboard or if it's... Because uh... I'm, I'm not clicking things correctly. I think I'm getting used to the keyboard again. Let's switch to my uh, old new keyboard, if that makes sense. I used this keyboard before and then the keyboard didn't uh, broke. And they sent me a new one. But I just switched to it now. I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm going heavy plow. Let's do it. I'm booming like a madman. Spearman defense, heavy plow. Let's go. <laughs> heavy plow and feudal age. This feels so wrong. Zero farms, by the way. Dude, I'm waiting for heavy plow, man. It's next level strats. That's maximum efficiency. That's what that's called. Nothing else. 375 food on my first farm. <laughs> Alright. Guess we do some walling. Don't be like this, hair man. No, no hair snipes in chat here. So we accidentally went for a okay plan with the heavy plow stuff. See how it actually plays out in the end. Does he have a range up? Why is he hanging around like this with the scouts like that? And is this where I drop like double stable and go and go for Don't fight my spears? Do I go... What I'm trying to say is, do I go double stable now and knights? Or do I go to castle age? And then do double stable knights? Yeah, something is wrong. I'm clicking keys and I don't feel like they go through. Not sure if it's patch or keyboard. Whew, that TC has ballistics, man. Right. Obviously, if he just added archers here, I would have been in trouble. But uh, we don't see signs of archers yet. Deck! What? Oh, 
Hmm. I will lose one villager. That's fine. Is the game running slower? I feel the game is running slower. Maybe it's something to do with the patch, uh, the server we're playing on. The game doesn't feel like super smooth, fast plays. Go, go for unique unit. Ooh. Costelier. You know what? I have backstone. You tickle my fancy. I like it. Stable is a debate. Actually, I could make a few knights. I could go cavalier. <laughs> I can go cavalier. There's so many options. What to do? What to do? Cavaliers are stronger. What's the HP on the Costelier? Okay, I have to say, my strategy is partly affected by the fact that I lost my scout to his TC, obviously, but yeah. 800. <laughs> okay, what's the HP in the game, not in the tech tree? 115? Okay. I mean, I could also go with like one stable. I mean, it's 150, 150, right? Let's go Cavalier, actually. We gotta try the, the new stuff. We will transition to the Costelier later, okay? Can one shot villagers. True, you have the charge attack. Or the shock attack, or whatever they call it. Wait, I could have done handcart in Feudal Age. I should have done handcart and then gone up. That's so insane. <laughs> Wait, I can do gold shaft mining. Oh my god. This is uh, this is gonna be so hard to get used to. I think I have to wall my base actually completely. Because He's going to have Cavalier, if he wants to. I'm doing one stable Cavalier. Probably not the best. Why even go to Castlage at all? You, you tell me. Do I, do a, I should probably do a second stable. Show me what you got, got. Maybe he goes Cav Archers. <laughs> I'm doing Cavalier. And both saw, a two men saw. What is this game? That was even by accident. <laughs> this is so ridiculous. We have to delete the mill because they want to go outside. Oh, he's going for Costelier. Okay, it's all good. All good. We got Cavalier. Takes a hell of a long time to research, though. You're dead, sorry, Viper. I, I've heard the, tells, the tales of this unit. <laughs> that was a one-shot. And they don't one-shot knights, though, or Cavalier, rather. So that should be a decent situation for us. We should probably do iron casting, actually, because... Because uh, they have that amount of damage output, and uh, probably doesn't make sense to even make armor upgrade. Make monks, yeah, I'm gonna do that as well. Because we have a relic bonus where we get food and gold from relics, right? <laughs> 22 minutes, I have two men saw, and I have cavalier. And he has 35 plus attack on these things. Holy cow. 8 plus 35. So th that unit is pretty much just going to be like a hit and run unit, right? You go in, you kill something, you get out. Team Game Burgundian Pocket Fast Paladin, let's go. 
You can do that, probably. Should be a pretty solid strategy with Burgundians. Oh! No, no, no. That food and gold is mine. I don't have any scouting, though, for relics. This, this, the whole dynamic of the game is just thrown, like, it's just so weird. Considering that you have these units and such. Oh. Ah, oh, shit. <laughs> I don't want to be attacked by this, this shock attack. I don't want to be shocked, man. Wait, are they slower? Or does it just not have husbandry? Maybe they're slower than actual... ...than other units. They are slower? Oh, okay. Well, that... I think that's a good way to balance them, I guess. But you just... ...go and make a hit, and then you run back and heal, and then... ...then you take it from there, right? Yeah, it's Costelier. It's a unique unit for uh, the Burgundians. Ha! I'm such a pleb. I did hand card and cast Lich. I don't know this game. Conversions are still instant. I didn't change that about the game. Or instant for some people. I guarantee you my conversions will take as long as they always did. I promise you guys. The yeah, issue is that since I lost my scout, I don't know where the relics are either. I'm not even sure if I will get any relics at this pace. Let's have a monk out, uh, cavalry, the light cav, scout cavalry out on the map as well. Get him! No relics for me. Feels bad, man. Because I'm gonna stick with Cavalier because I want to see how how good they do in in a straight up fight against those Costelier. Okay, we got absolutely spanked. <laughs> Wait, did I have that bonus against buildings as well? And does he have the relics? All five of them will be the. Oh, there's one. I can try and take. Let's try and go there. Okay, I need to go imp and get paladin. That's the plan, that's the plan. Ah, he's got the, now he's just gonna run back and heal up, right? You go in there, you do what you do your super damage, and then you go back and heal up. That's so stupid, okay. <laughs> and look, I lost half my HP on my Cavaliers, and he's just gonna run back and heal and wait for the next attack. Oh, that's gonna be a pain to deal with. You're gonna have to like really try and force fights against uh, against this Civ. I need my own my own thing. Run, run, run. We can do it. We get one relic. Please. Oh, we don't get any relics. Give me back my cavalier. Be nice. Or not. Come on, I need imp. I wanted to go, I just didn't have the... Let's see if I get the insta-conversion. Nope! Why would I, right? Why, why give Viper insta-converts? To be fair, I do get insta-converts sometimes as well. It's just... Very, very, very rare. Now uh, he's gonna get the relic. And I'm gonna cry. I know I get, I get insta-converts as well sometimes, okay? But it's a really bad part of the game. That's something they should balance. I 
Augu1134, thank you for the Prime. Just Cyan, thanks for the four months. Okay, this guy's going making a run for it. I might actually get it. Oh, not like this, I'm scared. Oh, he has the monk there. Well, one step closer, that's something. What's the unique upgrades again? Convert all food into gold. Ooh. What's the right time to do that? Probably not right now. There goes the relic. Let's just give up now. We go for Paladin and that's it. Go away with your 44 age attack. <laughs> 44 attack. I know it's still only one time per 30 seconds, but but still. Herbal medicine. Can't afford. I'm busy doing paladin upgrade. Oh, oh guys. Okay, guys. We're going for a power spike of paladin and Flemish villagers at once. Okay, guys. Oh, I'm excited. I am excited, boys. This is the push to win the game. Okay? This is the push to win it. How much is it? 800. Okay, we can afford it. Paladin. How fast is it? How far away is Paladin? Ah, oh, shit, it's still quite close. We have to go for one push. The good thing is, with this push, we are... He's gonna spend a lot of attacks on... Oh, wait, what? That research is so fast. Holy cow. Oh. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, issue. There's one issue, guys. He can also do the same. Because he is also... Uh, Burgundians. These dudes are pretty slow, aren't they? We have no bills. It's an all-in play, okay? 11 plus 41! They can have 52 attack! 52 attack! <laughs> Let's see how fast this trap goes down. Oh yeah, that was a good trap. Wait, Paladin is not even done? Oh my god, that was a waste. I took the fight way too soon. Okay, guys, we got a boom again. Did I make new villagers? I must have made new bills. There is no way all my bills didn't turn, right? <laughs> Shit. 50, 53 attack! <laughs> well. Okay, there's that. Yeah, I'm not, I have really... Mm, 140... Okay, so Elite Custodial. So you get 50... You can have... 55 attack. Your first hit will have 55 attack. And you are a horse, so you just hit things. And then you run back again and heal up and wait until you have the attack again. 145 HP. What does a paladin have? 180? 180, 145. Paladin has 18 attack. You will have 15 with a initial 55. Ah, well, how expensive? Aren't they like... 20 gold cheaper than a paladin as well. Oh, yeah. Five cheaper food, 20 cheaper gold. <laughs> and the elite upgrade isn't that bad either. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay, I think I know the first unit that might get some, uh, some like, get addressed slightly. That just seems... <laughs> I don't have words.
That seems pretty ridiculous. Wait, let me see your armor again. What's your armor? Plus two, plus two. So he's gonna have, he only has the first, a uh, second upgrade probably, right? So they're gonna have plus three, plus four. So they will have the same armor as a paladin. <laughs> Take away the armor. 82.5 attack downhill. And you know what? You also take less damage from halberdiers because of the sieve bonus. And your relics generate gold and food. And your, your uh, farms generate gold. And your gunpowder's attack 25% have 25 more attack. Wait, that's Sicilians? No, this is Burgundians. Wait, which one? What did I just say now? Wait, this is Burgundians, right? Oh, Sicilians have the damage. Oh, yeah, right, right, right. Okay, okay. Ignore that. So the damage is Sicilians. Okay, we're going to mix those up a lot right now. Gunpowder is 25% more attack. Stable technology is 50% cheaper. Economic upgrades available one age earlier. <laughs> All right. Well, at least they're bad on water maps, okay? Flemish Re Revolution is useless. Wait, 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 wait. Do I have any more Fleming? Okay. I didn't do any armor upgrades for infantry, so we didn't actually get to see how good they are, because I didn't have any upgrades. That's something you have to keep in mind as well. That was my bad. I would have won if I did the armor upgrades. Because <laughs> with extra two armor, I would have definitely survived those 82.5 attacks. <laughs> oh.